Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's Tuesday evening. We're back once again for more arty farty streaming. So I did some uh, not so work streaming yesterday and uh, looking at a red panda. It's nearly done. Uh, there's a few more little sticky things that need to be done on it, but it's uh, it's almost done. So I'm grateful for that. So we're back on this badge. This one we did a while back. I drafted it out. Customers happy with it. So next phase, as always, is rendering it out. So we're going to spend this session, hopefully this week, just to get this one ready. And then once this one's done, we work on the next one, which is the uh, Falcon, which is uh, where, where is it? It's this one. Well, actually, before I uh, maybe make a post that I'm streaming, tweet that out. Uh, um, let's there we go. Sam. There we go. Beautiful. Picasso is not streaming. Why is Picasso not streaming? It should be streaming. Hang on. Hear it? Picasso's being a bit of a goof. Picasso. Well, it's, it's submitting data to it, so it must be streaming. Bizarre. Anyway. So yes, um, what was it all about? Yes, the Falcon. Let me show you the Falcon. Uh, that's a retro one. Uh, there you go. This is the one. Yeah. Boom. So we've got two particular creatures that we, uh, that are gonna be, I'm going to be working on. So this, is, this will be the next one. But the first one is this one. It's Dragon. Uh, we're going to render it out. Get it done. In the session, I believe I, sh I should be able to get this all done <laughs> near final stages. So let's see what happens. I'm just gonna bring up the recorder, Camtasia recorder. Got my water, got my coffee as well. Mm. Mm. Where's the cap on this? I put this cap on. Keep the uh, ice cool in here. Oh, is it closed? There we go. So the temperature's gone down a bit, quite a bit uh, this week. Let me see. It was pretty warm yesterday, like 20 degrees. It's still friggin' warm. It's, right now, it's how much is it? Oh, hang on. It is 20, 22 degrees. Really? Hang on. 20 degrees. So if we round that off, I'd say in my room it would be about it'd be about 22 degrees because of the uh, P PC generating silly amounts of heat. So. But I got the window open, got fan blowing in cold air. What? Yes, yeah, blowing cold air. So we've got some some uh, airflow going. Hopefully, we'll get some insects as well with it. I've been bitten a few times already, so um, I'd rather get bitten by an insect than uh, than to you know get you know get caught by the heat. So uh, yeah, bad bits. There's a few windows here. Uh, oh. Yeah, why is this, this ain't working? Why is the Picasso not picking up the screen? It should be. Well, okay, well. Six cups of as a fruit smoothie. Oh my god, that's a, that's a lot of smoothie. That's a lot of smoothie. Yeah, not a that much smoothie in a long while. Usually nice to have a bit of smoothie. It's another great way of instead of having like a heavy breakfast that can keep you full for the most of the day. It's great. It's great stuff. Highly recommend it. Go smoothie. Okay. 
think I'm ready to start now. I'm just, just getting everything set up on my side. Actually, you know what? I need to bring up the Pure F folder. All the stuff I was working on. Let me see. Pure F. Oh. Pure F. And there we go. Saki. Saki Dragon. Oh. So I'm keeping this chap's uh, deets on my screen. Shock and shit. Yeah. Cool. Right. I think we're ready to begin. Um, so, before we do anything, this is ready to move on. So, we're going to make a new file. Uh, well, actually, you know, we're going to save a bit of time by just copying an existing one and moving it across. That would be the best option. So, uh, so you can probably get uh, um, the Rexor Rexonian one, Dave one. Build. Uh, we go to make a new foldable build. Yep. Call it uh, fancy Saki Dragon. Saki Dragon. Full. There we go. Let me open this up. Boom. We got this picture instead now. Whoa. If you remember this one, Whew. so we're going to delete everything. Boom, that's gone as well. we'll keep that. Actually, we know what we don't don't need that. Don't need that either. We're going to be copying that across. So it's all good. Actually, let me. I think I did copy it across. Let me check. Who I did? Yeah, I did. Yeah, no, I did. It's all good. We're all good. So. I'm going to separate a few things here. I'm going to clean up a folder as well. So we're going to get the dragon separated from the background. So there we go. Um, there we go. So background, dragon. Don't need all these things. So we're going to copy that, that, and that. Move that across. Lucky dragon fault. There you go. Tiny little dragon. Tiny little dragon. There you can do that. We can merge one. We can keep one. Keep that in the corner. That'll be the full on ref there. Right, but this one on the side, this is the one we're going to use. The proper, proper one. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Feel like this tube. Very nice. No, it's not nice and big. There we go. So we're we'll going to be working on this. Um, so for this, I think we can just crop that off, just cut off these little sections because uh, it's not really needed. Right? Don't need these things. Little props like that. There you go. Nice. So we'll save it now. Boom. Cool. I think we're ready. So we don't need this anymore. We can save that. Just close that down. There we go. So everything is set up. Everything is set up as we planned. And we'll drink some more coffee again. Hmm. So this is from the um, Netherlands. Dutch coffee. Dutch coffee with ice in it. Iced coffee. Very, very delicious. Very cool, chilling taste. So uh, yeah, good stuff. Right. Let's get, get this going. Let's get this going. Let's do this. Right, start the recorder. Make sure the recorder's stopped recording. There we go. Right, it's working. Good. Let's do this. So, first things first, make a new layer. Actually, first things first, we need to clean up our, like, clean up our layers. Anything we don't need, we can uh, knock it back. So that's been turned off. The line layer, this is the ink layer there, because we're gonna set it back to 60% for now. Because we're gonna be rendering some stuff out. And yeah, everything looks pretty damn good. Uh, the patterns are there. So this, we might, we, might, we might separate this as we go along. So we've got, we've got to make sure that it all, it all kind of adds, works together. 
Um, if I'm correct, this... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me check the reference here again. I think I might have done this wrong. Yeah, this has a fade on it. Why is that fade? Hang on, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let's, let's stop recording a second. So what's up here? No, that's not it. Hang on. Okay, where's the fade? So this character had a... F I did a fade on this, on the neck part. Unless it's, where's it gone? That is weird. Did I not save it? Let me just see. Saki. Ah, there it is. So a separate file. So a separate file. Let's do it again. Cancel that. Cancel that. Yes. Delete that recording. Wrong file. Wrong file. So. This is the one we need. So, hang on. Right. So, what we need to do is, what we need to do is if I open this, copy that. But I'm going to overwrite that one. Oh, I'm going to overwrite that file there. Replace it. Yes. There we go. So, we've replaced it. This is the file we need because it's got the, as you can see there, the fade. That fade is what was needed. So, Look this one. There we go. And we can close. Oh. I'll keep this as a backup. Well, old. Old. Right, so let's close all these ones down. Right, so if you open that one, it's old. That should be that one. And then if you open this, the other one. Yes. Good. Good. Right. Okay, now let's do, let's do this again. Uh, separate one from there. Yeah, so I need to copy this across again. Now again, there we go. So uh, there we go. Do it again. Do this down thing. There we go. Merge. Oh. Oh, okay. Let's merge that as well. There we go. That's the one. Swish. Go. Let me bring this one over. Oh. Scale this one up. There you go. Scale him up. Scale this big bruiser up. There we go. Perfect. Bigger the better. That's what I said. The bigger the better. There we go. Right. Now we're back on track again. Cool. Right. Save that. Now we can close this up <laughs> again. We can close this. Uh, save that. Good. Right. Now we start the recorder again. Asia quarter. Right, let's start. Oh. There we go. Right, it's working. Cool. Right, let's begin. Let's begin. We be spending too much time fighting around trying to get it to all come together, and it wasn't the wrong file. There. It's a good thing I noticed that because if I didn't. I would paint carried on working on it, I would have noticed it till the end. I'm like, oh wait a minute, you yeah. so I've got a dragon base. And then we make a, a new layer on top called Dragon Render, Dragon Render. Oh, comes for render, probably render. There you go. Right. Let's get going on this bad boy. Yeah, let's do it. Not much to do actually, other than just um Excuse me, gets getting refining, just refining things and bring it together.
yeah, little markings and whatnot as well. In fact, the line could this could go yeah, further down. Some really strong shadows in there just to make that mouth pop. That mouth pop indeed. In fact, I might make a new layer for that horn. Pull it horns, horn, front horn. So I'm gonna start, I may start breaking down some of these renderers just to focus on the particular areas so it just makes it easier. Well, it gets a bit confusing if you start to. Uh, Mess around specific specific things, right? Yeah, always try to uh, get it wet. Nice thing about this is that we're pretty much there. You know, we don't have to worry too much about being too long on this. But hopefully not too long, but because uh, everything pretty, is pretty much there, right? So I'm just gonna make sure everything kind of comes together, All right? So refining. So we're doing refining. All this has got reference on the side as well, so I've also got the same reference for myself so I can see so we go to the edge there Shut down there we go Teeth is going back as it should, it shouldn't have gone forward. So I've done the tooth that way, let me see if you can reference here. Okay, yeah, yeah. Well, the tooth more coming, coming more back, like that's much how it should be the fang. I really like that, like that. Yeah, there we go. Lotious. I don't think the truth would be visible too far from that side, maybe, but we'll see. We'll, go, we'll come back to that. Get my reference, sorry, all over the place right now. Also, last night on stream, I was watching uh, uh, what do you call it? What do you call it? Uh, Labyrinth. Labyrinth is a good show, good show, good film. Sorry, yeah. I've not seen it. Highly recommend it. it stars David Bowie. He's the Goblin King. Mm. 
very elegant individual. The film uh, it's got some really cool, cool songs in it. Cool special effects, particle effects. Very, very nice. Mm. Labyrinth. Check it out. These freck freckly marks, I'm gonna have to you know, reapply them again after I've uh, done my thing over them. Train going by my garden. Just got a little train running in the back. Should probably put these horns separate, so I might just do that now. Actually, just actually, uh, why don't you copy that? That, yeah, I might just copy those. Just about. the top ones as well these are oh got to pay some more layer there there you go there we go that's better that's better so I'll put them separate because at least that way I can focus on them after Sneeze coming. It's gone now. Hmm. Halon, it's really cool. I like this uh, piece. Something about it, colours, how it all comes together. It looks really nice. I think it made some good choices of uh, of uh, hues here. It's worked really well for this particular individual. It's got a second tooth. I'll have to. I have to consider, I have to put this in maybe. Let's, let's see how it looks first, and then if it's the case, then I'll just put another tooth in there. Right there. Mm. One right there. Let me see. So it's done the ref? Yes. Okay, you know what? You know what? I'll, I'll honor that. Maybe.
or two three things been going on there. Oh, tasty coffee. Mmm. I was messing with colour here. Eh? Keeping the hues consistent. I don't want to be careful not to blur too much, otherwise, it becomes start looking at, it starts to look a bit. Uh, Desaturated, and when, you, when it comes desaturated, you lose the, you start to lose the nice vibrancy in, in forms. So it's best to just apply shade where you need to. Yeah. So like that. So you just bring it together, bringing it all together. That line works gonna soon fade away eventually. I'm gonna make sure that. More reds, so I'll add some bit more reds, stronger reds, just to bump, bump that red values up. Look at that. Oh. In fact, this bottom area is going to be blip, it's going to be, it's not going to be visible. So, but I'm going to do it anyway. I've got to treat the entire picture as a unit, one big unit. It's not, it's not a tiny element. I've got to think of all of it, all of it. It's important to uh, keep an eye on that because otherwise uh, if you forget that then things start to fall apart and then that's when things get a bit wrong. There is a bit of a fade going on as well, I've realised uh, we've got a little reference here. So I'm going to bring some of this red up a bit, just a bit, just a slowly graduation, just bring it up and apply some of that red there. Maybe a bit dark. There you go. So it shows that bit of glow of red coming up to that, up to the uh, neck. This was a frill at the front, which I'm gonna keep it on a separate layer. I think that'll be that'll make more sense. There's no point of it painting it all at once. I like to keep things separate for the moment, and then I start to gradually bring them together. Have to be careful though. again. Gotta be careful. You easily lose yourself in blending and you realize that you've gone too far and then it all starts to look the same and then you've lost it. Reference here. Mm -hmm. I like this track, so the track's pretty nice. Why would someone do that? Twitter is a music, music platform. Here. To this. Hmm. 
You know, I've not watched any classic horror movies in a while. I might have to remedy this. I might have to, uh, you know, go back and uh, rewatch some of the classics again, like. Like Frankenstein and The Wolfman. The Wolfman is a really good film as well. Where it all began with those wolf characters, you know, werewolves and stuff. Obviously, the original werewolf doesn't look like a proper wolf, it's like just a man with a, there's a fur in his face, but still, it's a, it's, it's a classic. It's a classic, so I highly recommend it. You can see I've uh, kind of gone a bit far ahead on this, so I'm going to bring this one. Bring some stuff. So. Itchy, itchy wrist, and that's because I think there's an insect, got an insect bite, insect bite on my wrist there. Because I've got the window open in the past few days, and I think there's a, there's insects have crawling through, and then uh, you know, giving me the old little bitey bitey. Yeah, they like to bite, all right. Hmm. The things about insects—they're annoying. They are annoying. The ones that bite anyway. I want your blood? Suck your blood out. Those sneaky little insects. Let's take a closer look at this uh, neck frill on the older dragon. Oh, okay. So, yeah, I've I've done it. I should, I've done it like this. So it actually, comes out of the uh, out of the neck. I think that's probably better. Yeah, that's probably. I do like this song as well. This this song reminds me of Kickboxer, Kickboxer movie. Very very nice. When uh, what's his face? Uh, Jean Claude Van Damme doing his training, kick-ass training. Just a little bit of glow here, extra. So I've got a bit of a slight hint of like I'm not sure. Hmm, actually, that is. I'm gonna actually gonna merge this down because make it one layer. Commit to it. A bit of a. Yes, it's very kickboxery kind of track. I like this. Mm. Mm.
Oh, it's on the wrong layer there. Save. Don't forget to save. Hit the save key. Yeah, should be. Now I think it's going to be a chilled evening tonight because yeah, stream's pretty quiet. I've got treasure, oh, got treasure lurking, which is fine. Oh, yeah, come on, Photoshop, stop doing that. Doing its silly uh, pressure errors. Just gonna stop. Yeah. Start to slowly bring these. Masking away some of these things. I think that's probably a better rules of action. There we go. If that side tooth is visible or not, but I'm gonna I'm gonna try and mask it out. Trim it out if I can. Uh, it's not that layer. And there is on. Uh, blown on there. Find out when that layer is on. Oh, there you go. Yeah. I don't think that's that tooth's gonna be. There we go. It'll be, such, it'll be such a tight little lip that you probably won't even see it, so... Yeah. So there you go. That's probably that. It might be a bit too dark. Ugh. A bit stronger with shadows there. Gotta be careful. What's the backfill like? Backfill's are oh, okay. So backfill's not too bad.
experimenting here, see how it looks if it the uh, grill glowed through. I don't think it will glow as much, but uh, excuse me, but uh, we'll see. coffee mm. this is what's keeping me going right now the coffee fuel a few sips of that and away I'll go uh, I might pull on some Italo on the side I'm tempted because I've got synthwave playing it's great but some Italo would, would would be very nice about now um, and I can play it from my laptop because obviously if I, if I play it via Switch, you know, Switch will get upset, and then, you know, that's the end of that. The boom. You see, I can find it. My slow laptop is like incredibly slow, like a million years old. Wait for it to load up. Go on. Go on. There we go. Right, let's see. Uh, oh, oh. this also because it's still playing um right there we go this is the track i want stop that second oh place this in oh no place play there we go right i should do the trick Right, go back on this speech strip again. Back on the work, back to work. Back to work. That fierce looking on the dirt. There's white, yellow, there's yellow, yellow, uh, orange details, sorry, around around the eyes. I need to get that. I'll do that once the detail, you know, during the detail stage. That'll be, that'll be the best way to apply that. some extra orange, heated orange in some areas. So. Right, 
I think I did a bit of shadow there on the lock that back. There we go, bring that back there. And a bit of a and a bit of shadow there, hard shadow, hard shadow. It just makes it a bit more interesting. See edges, all those edges. Add some bit of a strong orange here, I think. This will be really good to really So give edge. Full edge on there. I've got to say thank you to Art Sprite for the follow there. Hit me with a watch just before I start the stream. It's like, it's like, hey. I hope you're still tuned in there. Thank you for the follow. Thank you very much. I'm gonna oh, I do need to have oh. Actually, guys, no, need a new window. There we go. Well, it could be a bot. Could be a sneaky bot. Sneaky bot. Oh, box hop. Cheers for the follow. -off. Potato and it's wet to you. A dog potato. Mm. Mm. Thank you. And welcome. Mm. Yeah. 
No worries. No worries. Hmm. Yeah, just having a chilled session tonight. We're working on comms, so... A bit cooler tonight than it was yesterday, so it's a, it's a nice... Uh, makes you feel a bit more... Uh, more productive, because when it's hot, it's, it's, it's a bit muggy, and it's muggy, it's difficult to get work done in a muggy environment. Especially in the UK anyway, right now UK was uh, suffering from a lot of heat. Nasty. Excuse me, they've got burp coming. Oh, there we go. It's from my coffee drinking. Mm. Might do that. There we go. Yeah, yeah, that's better. Yeah, probably to get this dragon done by the end of this session, but it's quite a lot to do. The scope of it. Zoom out a bit. It's taking shape, but still a lot to do. A lot to do. These are the horns, and then the frills, the eyes, and the little horns as well. It's actually, to be honest, there is not a lot to do. I'm just maybe I'm just worrying about it too much. I'm thinking, let's get it done. When you think about these things, uh, start to uh, get worried. Don't worry too much. Are you a streamer yourself, Foxhop? Do you do streamings? Are you just uh, someone that just enjoys just chilling out? Watching people doing the old broadcasting of themselves and that two from there. Not his stream though, probably should. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, it's it's hard work. <laughs> it's hard work. Um, a lot of people that say they want to do streaming, I'm like, yeah, if you want to stream, you should do it. But it's uh, it's take it can it can be it can sap a lot of energy out of you. But it's fantastic if you can keep up with it. You draw a lot. Nice, yeah. If you draw a lot, then yeah, definitely. I don't know you should consider do the older uh, streamy do that. I mean, I've seen other processes, yeah. Oh, my process, my process is pretty, a bit unorthodox. Um, I like to think. I just make it up as I go along. <laughs> I make it up. I should have. I mean, yeah, I should be using the process, but uh, oh, yeah, I just, I just do it. Just make it. make it as long as it looks good if it looks good then you're on the right track if it looks whack and there's something definitely wrong something definitely wrong then you have to take it back to the drawing board and get it right get it done right that's a bit more bright on just warm that here you go warm edge there we go this is good mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
So what kind of uh, artwork do you do? Like, is it toony? Fine art? Semi-realistic? What sort of art do you like, do, do you like to make? You definitely do the same, okay. Ah, oh, so, uh, re semi-realistic? Well, realistic? Uh. Oh, oh, right, 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 right. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. In the end of the day, it's all about making results. Um, but I mean, if I was doing this properly, I mean, this this kind, I mean, this process I'm doing right now, I kind of thought, kind of, there, there, there is a process in place. There is something I'm doing that. <laughs> because if I was doing wishy washy, then it, or I'd be this this picture would have taken would be taken a lot longer than this. So I'd be all over the place. But uh, yeah. Um, I'm, I'm kind of like winging it so that I feel more, more relaxed than. But no, 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 yeah. Sometimes I do break the boundaries a bit and do my own thing. If that makes sense. I, I think that's that's that's. The... What's the right word to say it? I mean, hmm. I mean, like I, I, I'll, I'll follow a rule, which gets the work done. But if there's something wrong with the picture, then I'll break away from that process just to get it done. You know, like, yeah. Uh, draw or what? Kind of more concept up for video games, storyboard, but want to get better at like, painting styles, such as what you're doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd recommend, uh, I mean, my, my favorite artist for master painting was uh, John Singer Sargent and uh, Thomas Moran. Check out Thomas Moran, M-O-R-A-N, Moran, Thomas Moran, and John Singer Sargent. Those two were really good painters for their time, especially for landscapes. Uh, Sargent did a lot of people stuff, but really, they, 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 I like to get, they're considered, they're considered as impressionist painters, I think. Well, I'm not sure about Thomas Moran, but Sargent was a, a, an impressionist painter. I, I, I like, I, I've been considered to be more in a, 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 a Impressionist side than uh, realistic, I guess. Uh, Cause I, I think impressionists come from the Western side of thing of the world of globe. So uh, yeah, definitely worth checking them out. Uh, yeah, yeah. I did, I've done a I've done a master study painting of one of Sargent's pieces. You probably see it on the on the bottom here of a bloke, man with a beard, with, with a moustache and stuff. You'll you'll see it at the bottom up here, shortly. Um, uh, yeah, I, I've I've I, I I basically just painted his painting basically imitation, like observing observation painting as he call it, and uh, that that helped me a lot in terms of uh, you know identifying. Then it find uh, you know how he painted, and it helps me create my own process from that, my own process of painting. If that makes sense. Uh, yeah, just just look at his stuff and uh, paint. Just see what. Uh, but yeah, if, if I, I've, yeah, there is there is there is a speed paint video video of it on YouTube. Uh, I've done. Um, yeah, it's fun interesting as well because uh, because um, when people say they want to paint like a specific like a specific artist and stuff observation painting is the way it makes it you, you because you're spending time learning for yourself and you're figuring it out for yourself uh, it's a great way so it's 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 like you're scientifically breaking down the problem yeah you try you you reverse engineering the, the this artist's work and it's great 
And from that, you might find a better process. You might find same bet, same thing. You know what? Maybe Sergeant did something specific, something that you can bet, you can best. You can say, oh, you know, he did it this way. I can do it this way, this way, but much quicker. So you become you become more familiar with with uh, approaching things more effectively. So it's nice. A nice uh, way to do studies like that. Definitely won't start doing that more. I've only really studied studied junior 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 jitsu, like that college. What's what's junior itsu? Is, it, is that an artist? <laughs> Who is that? Let me, let me Google that. Okay, new words. Okay. All oh, right. Manga artist. Okay. Oh. Oh wow. Okay. He's done uh, some 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 bunch of mangas. Hang on, let me just let me, let me click on this. Let me find out what any if I know any of them. He's done Frankenstein. Wow. These are horror. These are like horror horror um, and mangas. They're horror stuff. Interesting. Tommy. Yeah, the Frankenstein one looks interesting. I was just talking about Frankenstein a few minutes ago, a few a few moments ago about what we watching some of the classic. Uh, Universal monster monster movies. Bor yeah, Boris Karloff. He played. Yeah, he played. Uh, Boris Karloff played uh, 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 Frankenstein. He's known for that. In fact, like the, the, you know, the, the flat top head and all that. There's a lot of body horror, yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. From, from looking at his his covers, you know, looks they look very spooky. Very spooky, yeah. Is it is that the direction you want to take your work? Horror. Horror stuff. Horror art. in place Chin frills as well, the chin frills. Chin frills. and find a way that these frills are kind of 
visible coming out from the shimmer or something. There we go. Some sort of growth. So chin chin for growth. Off a bit so see the light center. There might be some lighting on this just a little. So, pick up again. Coffee gives me one of the older pickups. Pickups. just using a big brush a kind of semi brick brush just to block in these things Some of that glow here, just a really strong glow here. Just to, there we go. Hmm. It's a bit cooler now, which is nice. More hot, warm weather coming in through the window. I might have to, during the detail part, I might just refine this down a bit more. But I'll leave this as is. I think it's fine. Right. Horns still left to do. The frills at the top we should go back to that again. But well, there's this. It's the next. I call, it, I call it the chin frills. Chin frill. I'm going to make sure I get this looking as possible. So I've got some side music playing on this on my on my side. So I'm not listening to synth, I'm listening to Italo music, which is uh, unfortunately uh, Twitch, nor Twitch or uh, YouTube would like it. No, YouTube that YouTube is when it comes to playing copyright music, so can't enjoy it. Need my Italo fix. <laughs> Gets me in the zone. Horns in there. Little tiny little horns.
Right. Yeah, let's look at. So the frills are kind of okay. Um, actually, they're not. And you know, pay attention to so like this is why I keep the I this is why I always keep the thumbnail next to the, the, the painting or whilst I'm working on it so I don't lose the original. Because the original sometimes has a bit more, you know, a bit of energy in it. Very good, good little handy thing to have. Side of your screen. Might have some blue in that later, maybe. But, uh... everywhere. Add some some blue in there. Just a bit, a little bit blue, just to give it, make it part of the picture, part of the background. You don't, you don't want it unified. The moment you start unifying the painting with colours of the base colours of the uh, dragon, then it, it looks a bit boring. That's why I got, I've got blues and all sorts of colours going in, happening in there. So it makes it makes it a bit more fun. made a layer called Talons and work on these now. So again, I'm not going to... all about just cleaning it up, basically. As you can see there, I'm not going to... I'm not going to spend too long on them, but enough to just, you know, refine. And refine. That's all, it is. all I'm doing. So... Boom. Actually, the horn has. Let me just check references here. Okay. You know what? The horns have do have a specific pattern on them, so I'm gonna. I think my line work. May have had that, but that's fine. You know what? I can probably bring it back in again. Just uh... oh, well, let me just copy that. There we go. Oh. There we go. So there's the patterns here. 
from looking at it. Let's move uh, this up and then over. So I don't think that that would be the same. So I may have to do my own version here. Sleep on these shapes and then I'll uh, Pressing <laughs> addressing that. No, there you go. There, there, there we go. Bring back some of that nice little gloss there just to really pop that back. No, excuse me. Mm 
Yeah, I need to be careful. Oh, don't lose that glow, that gloss. I'm gonna lose it there. I'm gonna try and bring some of that blues back. There you go. <laughs> Once we race that actually when I'm done with actually. One side one, let's <laughs> open the other one. Mm 
uh, underneath. Oh, yeah. That should probably go underneath as well. Ha, oh, there we go. Probably fix. You know what? Uh, let's put let's put this back up here. Well, let's tell it right. Get on left. Easier. There you go. Hmm. It's kind of there. Yeah, sometimes I find if you listen, if you listen to the right music, you get into that zone, you know. Music is also important. Right music, the good kind of music. Makes you more relaxed. A bit of a stretch. Oh, yeah, a little stretch. Let me just pause the recording a second. Yeah, it's been one hour 33 minutes, so we've got about oh, about an hour left. See how, how quick time flies when you are streaming. See, time just flies through. Now, um, how much have I done so far? Well, okay, so. We've done most of the rendering so far, we've just got to do this tail on, these ones, then the outside here, and then these markings. And then I think it's then ready to um, work on the detail part. The detail part of, oh actually the eyes as well, I'm just a little bit refining on the eyes, and then, yeah. Then go to the details part, obviously the detail has all these sort of freckly things, what I've done here. There's patterns there that needs to be addressed, and obviously the, um, for the detail on the horns as well. I didn't really, I didn't really do much on that, but then also work, work on the details on the teeth as well. Really little refinements like that, and then the frills, and then look at everything as a whole, and then slowly start to just bring it together. And yeah, yeah. I think the uh, this bit needs to be fixed as well. I was looking at it now. I think I went too far on the shadow there. So I need to rest that. Oh. Uh, 
not so there you go. Nice little glow there in there. Rim glow. Halon on the right, that. Oh. That's the ice detail, okay. So what I'll do when I'm done with this, I'm going to erase the outline down a bit and make that's little bumps. So right now I just put my bumps going on there. Yeah. Same here as well. Uh, right. Let's work, let's focus on the these talons as well. So I've got it. Cheek tail on, tail on big. And yeah, this has markings on it as well, so. She, she might, might, might just get away with this one. We'll see. Blue to it instead, instead of that. some of that
add a bit of blue in there as well again, just to really give it a little pop. Uh... Still got the front I want to do as well. I forgot about that. I want to run the front. Right in the front, I did a little bit of touching on it, but didn't really spend more time on it. Went on to other things. So, yeah, I'll come back to that. Tail on small. I think that's one of the smaller ones now. There's some glow here, reflective glow. Again, stretch my hands. Well, I've got to uh, pass the link to the first the customer, I'm, so I'm working on it. Yep. Oh, this coffee. Woo. Intense coffee. Intense caffeine. That's what I'm getting right now. Buzzing right through me like a. Brrr. So, yeah, I'm just a little break at the moment. Just 
it's always good to have short breaks because if you, uh, you know, constantly, uh, you know, go at something, you may, you know, your wrist starts getting a bit knackered and stuff. So always take always take regular breaks wherever possible. It's good for you. But even on streaming, I mean, a lot of streamers do that and. Uh, mm. I think it's important to um, have little breaks now and then. Well -being, the well-being of yourself is important. Well-being of yourself is very important. Always, never forget that. Never forget that. Always uh, look after yourself when doing things, when you're doing something creative. You know, take some take regular breaks. Normally, if. Uh, I'd be working on this piece outside the stream to get it done quickly, but I've been focused on getting in all these pe all these ones done only via stream. And uh should probably hasten up because obviously I've had some people already asking me if if I'm opening for for more commissions and I'm like, oh, I'm still going for the ones that I've got from the convention, you know? So uh should probably Hustle up a bit and you know get these done right, rather than hanging on to them. Just means you won't be able to see it getting done like this in real time. You only get to see it when I'm uh, put on YouTube. Just a little loss of blue, just a little that. there fox hop hope i've not bored you up <laughs> normally when i'm out rambling you know sometimes it gets a bit uh, too much i ramble perhaps i should bring in the, the, the spud the super spud he knows he knows what to do I forgot about mr S mr spud it's like the uh, alter ego of mine he's like he does everything he does all the horror gaming and stuff Pretty badass. Let's, let's bring him forth. Let's bring, let's bring him forth. Whoop. Ooh. Well, well, well. Ooh. What do we have here? Looks like we've got some uh, dragon thing going on. Yes. Let's review it. Let's, let's, let's take over and get some work done on this. Yes. Yes. Let's do it. Hmm. Magic. Okay, so we've got the trail on here. Oh. The blue in. Oh, blue. There we go. National Globe. Hmm. If you just joined in, it looks like I've mysteriously turned into a potato. Hmm. Spudulistic antics. That's fine. Grants me extra super potato powers to get this piece done now. Look, oh, I'm in the zone now. Oh. Hmm. 
Excuse me, it's got to happen. Whoops. What's going to burp? Spud burps. Mm. Oh, yes, the horn. Yes, I forgot about that. Let's just get the front tail on. Tail on front. Call it all. Tail on front. There we go. I don't think nothing needs to be done on this one either. It's just a little bit of a. Oh. It's going on there. Reach the top. There we go. What? Go on there. Oh, front horn. Oh, there is a front horn. Oh, well, my bad, my bad. My bad. There was one. There we go. There we go. Oh, oh the music has the music stopped. Oh, yes, there we go. Miami Voice. Oh, 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 Looking at the uh, references. Let's go, let's go. Go to those. Done. Lost my uh, touch. There we go. Just the dashboard. Disappearing dashboard. All good. Dashboard disappears. That's when things go wrong. There we go. Yes.
There's still a fair few things to do. We've done, done, done a little hole in there. Done a little horn. Yes. We'll, we'll call that front horn deets. Front horn deets. 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 Yes. But the little horns as well. Little, little tiny, tiny talons. We'll call it tiny talons. We'll start adding doing a bit of this as well. Let's look into this and uh, get it all nicely done. Mm. Right, instead of doing this, I'm going to do a mask. There we go, it's a mask. Yes. The spikes look a bit too sharp. So now, soften up a bit, soften a little shop. Add a little, little, uh, little tips, little, little nuggets of blue on those little tiny channels. Gives a little more interest there, yes. Make this one a bit bigger. Someone listens to called Loogie Loogie Loogie. Very nice. And um, there's a tallow track. Very nice. I see a lot of people playing this uh, Cult of the Lamb. I don't know if I should be, if I should be interested in getting such a thing. I don't know. I mean, there can't be a potato in it. No. There can't be a potato in it. Yes, thank you very much. Yep. Who would have thought a potato can paint? Yes. My starchy... The starchy brush. Very spudgy list. Hmm. Potato tastic. There you go. Oh. My god, you can type in potato icons, though. I am an artist, yes. I am a potato artist. Potato. Potato. Mm -hmm. 
Potatoes again, yes, yes. No, I've got, um, I've, got uh, I've got a gang of potatoes, yes. They're, they're, they're very good, very good. They're very good, yes. Are you, a, are you an artist as well, Toto? Are you, do, you, do you do some art things? See if we can slowly remove. Oh, the line's gone. Oh, very good. Very good. Well, let's just get the uh, the shoulders done, and I think then we can start working on the details. Details. That's the fun part. Of this painting. The fun part is the details. So we spend hours doing details. I'm going to hold the horizontal flip it. Boop. And cheeky flip. You flip it, you can, uh, helps you refresh your eyes a bit as well. It's very good. Very clever way of, of uh, doing so. You know, it gives you a little respite. A little respite to see uh, if there's anything wrong with the picture. Fortunately, with the uh, thumbnail, uh, I did a good, good little check on that. So, yeah. Looking at what uh, what things I may have missed out on, looks like there's a few things I've refined, but uh, Don't forget to uh, do a cheeky follow if you like my stuff, Toto. You get potato sent to you. You get a potato sent to you if you, if you, if you do a follow. Oh, yes. Let's look at some teeth as well. There we go. One window. Uh, your left, there we go. Your left.
Ich bin... Oh, hmm, yes. That looks more fearsome to me. Very fearsome. Very fearsome. Hmm. He needs more red under the lips. There we go. Hmm. Very, very fierce. Very first and dying a dragon sword? Dragon Dragon Sword Dinos Dragon Sword. Hmm. Yeah. Some form of mystical beastie. Got a little, little, little lisp, lisp, lisp thing going on, so I'm gonna try and honor that lisp. No chin now. Mouse, uh, well, it's probably angle this a bit. There we go. Oh, there we go. Probably draw properly with a straight angle or to. Blue in there, saturated blue on there. There we go. Yes. A bit of sat saturation on the front part there, just to give it a little pop. It does make the front bit more vibrant, means uh, it's the focal part. Hmm. Focal point. The front horn again. Front horn. Here we go. Hmm. Hmm. 
Let's add a little little uh, gap in the, in between the tail on just to, it looks like it looks like it's part of the bone. You know, got to think about these things. You can't just put things spouting here and there. You know, you have to think about these little things. Okay, you know, the same here as well. You know. So, there's a little bit more interest, you know, interest on uh, where, is, where is this coming from? Where is this growing from? Yeah, you know, big, big, little, oh, yeah, look at that, yeah, yeah, it's okay. Then there too. So, let's give it a little interest, a little, uh, little, little understanding that there's a uh, little uh, things popping out here. Yes. In there too. Little. In each each uh, little horn, little. You no. Know. Little, little bumps. Little bumps. Bumps. Of course, on that side will be visible, but that's fine. We can, we can live with that. But as you can see, it looks a bit more, uh, yes. Little things like that. Makes it, makes it a little, little nice to look at. A little nice to look at. Yes. Yes. Flip it again. Whoop. Whoop. Ah. The little, no little to take the stretch. So, let's see what else there is to do. The eyes, yes. Oh, yes, the eyes. Yes. Got that, guys. And uh, this, this part as well. Yes, there we go. Oh, this whoop, mysterious little icon there floating around on my screen.
Okay. It's the eyes, let's look it up. Uh, there we go. It's the eyes there. Look at the uh, reference again. I'm trying to see if his eyes are glowing. I don't think they're glowing eyes. No, 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 no. No, no glowing eyes. No, no, his eyes don't glow. His eyes don't glow. That's fine. This is good. Let's make sure that's over there. I don't think it needs that gloss, I think. Gloss is uh, necessary, I think. There we go, that's better. some references again. Always keep checking on these references. Always gotta check. You never know. Hmm.
Okay. So I'm remembering to make sure I fix the horns as well. And let's get the uh, pattern sorted as well. Let's look at that pattern. Um, now, where is that? Some here, I think. Nope. Next we go though. Oh, nope, that's not it. Nope. Oh, where is the pan? Where is the pan? It feels. Well, do you rely on the old fashioned uh, selection? Nope. It's the background. Nope. Uh, nope. 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 Where is this? Nope. Try the bench 73. Ah, here we go. There we go. That's the one. Ah, oh, Ooh. neck, neck pan. So, we I think we should move this up into the old uh, rendering section. There we go. Oh, so it comes up. It all comes up like that. We can now uh, refine it down a bit. Go. And bring it down to this. Yeah, oh, there we go. Oh. New layer, neck pattern. We've got neck pattern base. But uh, neck pattern render. So all we want to do is soften and refine this pattern. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I see a uh, rogue blazer. You snuck in. Is the rogue blazer? Very sneaky. Very sneaky. Sneaking hmm. around. Don't, don't you think? Don't think I don't see it. I notice it. Hmm. Ah. I see you. Beep. 
plunge in Goshi. Plunge in Goshi. And I'll shrug on my coffee. And uh, we oh oh I just realized that we we reached uh, two hours twenty seven mark. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. But I don't have a lot of time left, it seems. I'll, I'll, I'll push in another 15 minutes, I think. Another 15 minutes of stream time? Hmm. But uh, yeah, we're making some good progress here. And next, I think tomorrow's session, it'll just be about adding a little de details here and there. And then this piece is done, and I could probably jump straight onto the next one. Yes. Oh, yes. I just noticed I should probably add a little paintbrush next to this, my uh, my uh, avatar self. Makes more sense, doesn't it? If I have a little paint, little paintbrush, a little paintbrush, or a little stylus. Yeah. There we go. Hmm. Hmm. She knows it all. And she knows too. Mm. She knows the common. Hmm. Oh, well. she was. The laptop was a bit slow there. What's she was doing? Not sure what it's doing. The laptop. Oh. Okay, so yes, the pattern looks looking pretty good there. I like that. I like that. Hmm. Now look like a new layer for the other side of the shoulder there. about a yeti. Hmm. See, Tallow music. They write songs about any old thing. And it sounds really, sounds really cool. Yeah. Right. It's good, looking good. Uh, okay, details. Little bits of details that I need to focus on now. This is the little, little, little marks on the faces and stuff. So I make a new new uh, thing. Call it detail. Details. Call it scale marking. Scale marking. Oops. Oops. Yeah. Um, so we've got a reference again. Yeah. Seems uh hmm, seems this should be more reddish. Uh, still a uh, reddish kind of markings. Yeah. Oh there we go. Not too red. It's uh more like this, I think. More like this reddish hue.
Song about a yeti. Hmm. Well, what a time to live in. Yeah. Song about yetis. Hmm. Sadly, I can't share the song with you because it's, uh, you know, copyrighted. But I think the rights YouTube won't let me play it. All right. is fine there. Yes, but...
probably use a circle for this, I think. Well, circle here. I think this one's only things I'm gonna chill on, well, maybe not. Yeah, I don't like that. Right. Let's get rid of that. I don't think I don't I never like that. The uh, right trail on, big right trail on, that's the one, yes. Let's fix this, uh, this markings here. Uh, Of a uh, yeah, of course. So, it's back. Oh, nope.
Ist auch noch mal her. The meat is stopped again. Well, that's not good. There you go. Well, I should probably stop the stream soon. Come past the... Come past the limit again.
Well, it fixes as well. Right, I think we should call it time here. Make some good progress. Yeah. Let's uh, stop recording it. Not much to do. How long have we been streaming for? Let's see. Let's see on uh, Twitch. Because Twitch will give me a better. Two hours 49 minutes. But I've done a reporting here. Two hours 27. That's pretty respectable. So stop. Mm -hmm. Four. Yep, saving it out here. Very nice. Just a quick skim through here. Hmm, yes. It's very nice. Very nice indeed. There some, there'll still be some more work to do tomorrow. Uh, we we'll need to add some more details here and there, and then finish off with the background, and then uh, I think this piece is done. Well, we'll be back tomorrow as always, people. Uh, thanks for joining me. And as always, uh, keep watching the skies. Keep watching the skies. Yes, yeah, so I'll pass it back to Zod, and he can uh, look do his little exit exit speech. And then, uh, yeah, thanks for joining me. Over to Zod. Yep. Whoop. Oh, Mr. Potato. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yes, uh, as uh, as always. Yeah, thanks for joining me, guys. I'll be back tomorrow. Just got to get the the uh, detail side of this done in the background, as as, as Spud said. So yeah, thanks for joining me guys, and as always, uh, keep watching the skies, keep watching the skies, and I'll see you peeps tomorrow for more paintings of dragon and other stuff. So yeah, take it easy guys, and have a lovely day, and uh, yeah, see you guys soon. Bye! <laughs>